Game one, Western Conference semifinals in Denver with a 37 to 19 second quarter. Jack, who's this? Opens it up, 68 51. Oh, oh right, right. Henry Buffett. No, wait. Hey, Denver. Denver. What kind? What kind of move? Move me and y'all playing? Biggest cut. Just that's that's Jimmy Buffett. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was John Denver. No, not John Denver. Hey man. 5851. No, it's your halftime score. Hey. So Denver puts this big run together, creates some space without Joker on the floor. It's guys like Michael Porter Jr., Aaron Gordon getting things done. Kenny's going to talk about that aspect of the first half. We're going to start with something that you guys were talking about at length in the pregame show, and that is the impact of DeAndre Ayton in this series for Phoenix. Yeah, I'm keeping my eyes on the uh, matchup. Ayton, listen, he's, he's <laughs> playing pretty good. I would like him to play with a little bit more force, but he has 10 points. Joker has 13 points. Right here, when you get your opportunity, you got to take the high percentage shot and score. Right here, Joker's not worrying about you. We need you to rebound. We need you to average about two or three of these a game and go up strong. You're supposed to dunk that one. And right here, seal. <laughs> seal, Ernie. That's the seal sound. Uh, not really. Let's and jump, ahead. hook him to death. And right here, you see how Joker plays him? This is how he should be playing Joker. You see that pressure? Look at that, Ernie. Ah, swipe him. Boom, move him. And it forces Aiden to take a, a tough shot. Well, yes, when Joker gets the ball, Aiden should play him the same way. That was a seal sound. Yeah. I just came back from SeaWorld this morning. Yeah. Well, you <laughs> Was that the six seal uh, section? No, that's how I talk to him. Shaseel O'Neal, Ernie. Uh, okay, I got you. Uh, Shaseel O'Neal. <laughs> by the way, Durant has you 19. Seen that meme? And Booker's got Somebody 14. Somebody pull that meme up for Ernie. You never seen Shaseel O'Neal? No, I haven't. But okay, watch. Let's, see. let's move on. Um, Durant 19, Booker 14, aiton has got 10. Um, Joker 13 and 14, but, uh, man, Porter and Gordon and... The rest, I mean, Denver just opened it up on these guys in the second quarter. Shaq, no. do, it. do not take He's off. He's not. Do not take off. No. Because if you take off. Oh. Hey, I got it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I have somebody who was ready for you. That's Chris I Tucker. I want a 4-3, man. No, no, Y'all you... can't keep doing Kenny no, like you this. You got to keep you 4-3. Keep, keep doing my dog like this. <laughs> you said you 4-3. He don't have to run no more. Thank you. I had help today. I was like, you don't want none of that. Okay. You don't want none of that. But anyway, before we get it, we're going to have you up here. But we're going to go to the board, Chris. And one of the things I talked about was Aaron Gordon, and I also talked about Michael Porter Jr. Chris, these guys are big for the Nuggets, and I thought they have an advantage because right here, Shamit cannot guard this guy right here at the elbow. So put him at the elbow, isolate him. He's just going to shoot right over him. It's like shooting over a chair. Gets the shot. Again, Gordon, set the pick, or you have it. Now Chris Paul's on you. Chris Paul's on the post. Too little, too much. But then Gordon finds a way to slice in. These two guys are too active. They're kind of like Chris running up here, a little bit too active. Running up down. Young blood. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. We don't have to watch no more. Because I got, I always going to have backup now. Always going to have backup in here. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to see you again, man. You yes, sir. You. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm mad at you. What'd I do, man? I told you to meet me at the back of the diner. Not at the front of the diner. <laughs> no, man. Oh, the back man. Of the... <laughs> Chuck. Hey. All right, come man. Come on. Come on. Let's talk about Aaron Oh, second. Let's do it. You so, know, you in the movie, man. I know. Charles actually helped me with my role. I oh. called you for research because I play Howard White in okay. the new movie Air with Ben Affleck, Matt Damon, Viola Davis, and I had to. I called Charles, and he was so gracious to tell me about Howard and yes. how he influenced your life. He, he's a great influence in my life. He re, he babysitted me and Michael till we learned the ropes, and you did a fabulous job. Hey, so man, is it weird playing a regular a person instead of acting? You know what's harder. You got to do a lot of research, man. And, and I locked myself in a hotel for like 20 days, called you and 20 of uh, Howard's other friends, man, and did the research, man. But it was fun. It was fun. Once you get it down, it's fun. He told me about your grandmother, Granny. I had oh, a yeah. Granny, too. Oh, yeah. And how, I, how she influenced you. And they were really good friends. And in the movie, Michael Jordan, how his mother influenced him mm -hmm. to uh, make the right decisions. So it was great, man. It was Chris, great. we had Ben Affleck on the, uh, on the podcast talking about it, too. And... We'll tell you the same thing we told him. It's, the story is so well told. It really Thank is. You. It was. A, it's a great film. Thank and, you. And Thank enjoyed you. every second of Thank it. Thank you. Man, really. We had a lot of fun. Thank you. Yeah, he, 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 um, unbelievable. You know, first the ATLian, 
we got we got to get you on the boat sooner or later when they lose. I know. But the second part of it, you I always know, wonder about that. Where he, me? Where he, am I? He was a great in the movie, but he was terrible at my celebrity poker tournament in All Star Weekend. But I was good dancing on the stage. <laughs> though. He's good That's Kenny throw the best parties I, I, he, ever. He All Star. He was good on and the stage. And I did Michael Jackson on the stage. He did. He did the whole. And I get paid to do Michael Jackson, man. He did Michael Jackson. Let me see it right now. A little bit of mine. Yeah, right down the front. You know how? You know. Oh. Y'all ain't got no music, though, man. This is, oh, like, we got music. Music. This is like playing a white comedy club. Y'all ain't got no music. <laughs> what the music got? What the music wait, we got? Wait, I don't what know. What the music? I can't just freestyle, Mike. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, see. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, I don't think we can afford Michael Jackson. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, we, man, right there in front. Do, 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 Chris Tucker on demand. Thank you, man. That's awesome, yeah, exactly. man. Hey, go Always see the movie good to see. Air. Man, go man. out of still in theaters. Man, did go he, see did he turn on the Jets right here? <laughs> oh! Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh Shaq, you were looking the yeah. wrong way, guys. Uh, you don't want to. I'm looking just like Kitty. Man, there you go, brother. My shirt is all out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, thank you all so much. Man. Learn more at AmericanExpress.com slash triple double. <laughs> How about that performance that by good. Chris Tucker here in Stide Studio? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, uh, oh, get it, uh, girls. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my God. That was pretty funny. That was quick, too, guys. That was good.